Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Attack of the B-Team. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to make an infinite power source for powering your devices that need redstone flux. So, you're going to need a couple of items. You're going to need a magmatic dynamo, or two, a lava fabricator, some redstone energy conduits, or any conduits, some fluid ducts, and optional redstone energy cell, or any energy cell. First thing you want to do is place your lava fabricator somewhere. Then you want to connect a energy conduit to it, and then adjacent or facing that, you want to put a magmatic dynamo. Now put the fluid ducts on top of those three items, and then take a bucket of lava and put it into the magmatic dynamo. You will see this is powering this, which is making lava, which is then being taken back to fill this thing up. Now you can see it is full of lava. And this is going to be an infinite loop. The power is just going back and forth into there. Next, take some covers from micro blocks, place it there on top of the lava fabricator, there um, next to the energy conduit, and that's good. Place another en energy conduit on this cover, and then place another magnetic dynamo facing that and put a fluid duct on top of that. Now you're good. This energy conduit can go wherever you want to power your items. For example, if I wanted to put an energy conduit here, it is now filling up. And this thing is still full of lava, so it'll infinitely make energy, and this thing will fill up of energy once this thing is full. After a while, it'll fill up. If you want it to go faster, I think this might work, I'm not actually sure. Let's test it here. Given that cover will connect those two, and maybe it'll fill it faster? Uh, actually no, because the max input is not 80. But, if you put energy conduits there, it'll start going down a little bit. But now, it should fill it faster. I think that's what happens if you connect it in multiple places, it'll fill up even faster. But that's that, and the energy can go through some covers, hollow covers if you want, lead it downwards, or you can always connect more magmatic dynamos with fluid ducts to get even more power going through these redstone energy conduits, because they can hold uh, 10,000 redstone flux, which is a lot. So, thanks for watching this episode of Attack of the B Team Tutorials. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.